Okay, we're going to have a little look at 1.6, converting the following denary numbers into hexadecimal. Okay, what I'm going to do with this, I'm going to start with A. I'm going to write down 1, 16, 2, 5, 6. So, 1 times 16, 16 times 16, that's 2, 5, 6. Well, we need to put... 98, which is base 10, into, into this. So, first of all, obviously, nine, 256 doesn't go into 98, but 16 does. But how many times, how many times does 16 go into 98? 98 divided by 16. Well, 6 times 16 would equal 96. So I can put a 6 in here. Okay. And how many is left over? There's 2. So 98 would equal, in hexadecimal, 62. 6 times 16 equals 96 plus 2 times 1 equaling 2. So that would equal 90. Eight. Nice and simple. Okay, we could always convert this figure into binary and then do the. Um, we could always convert this into binary and then split it into nibbles, which would be an easy, easy, easy option as well. But this is the way of doing it for, straight from decimal into hexadecimal. Let's have a little go at E826. So here we go. I'm going to go and put one. 16, 2, 5, 6, 2, 5, 6 times 16. We're not going to need 4 and 96. 8, 2, 6. Well, how many 2, 5, 6s go into 826? So 3 times 2, 5, 6 would be 68, would be 768. So I'll put a 3 in there, and that's 760. Eight. Well, let's take that away from that. 826 take away 768. That would give us a total of 58. So we need to work out how many 16s would appear in 58. Well, again, that would be 3, because 3 times 16 equals 48. So I'm going to take 48, 48 away from that, which would leave us 10. So it would be 33a. 3 times 2, 5, 6, plus 3 times 16, plus 10 times 1. Okay, so we do one more. Okay, this time we'll have a little go at j. 5,000. Now obviously I've left this on the screen. Um, 4,096 goes in one time. So we could then take that, like we did before, take that away from that. 5,000 take away 4,096. Now 256, that must, as before, equal 3. 3 times 256, because 3 times 256 equals 768. So 7, 6... Eight, and we'll take that away from that. And please be aware we don't have a calculator in the exam. So you polish up on your subtraction and addition. 904 take away 768. So we have 136. 136 divided by 16. And that goes in... So 136 divided by 16... 8 16s equals, 8 times 16 equals 128, I believe. So we've got 8 left over. So the answer should be 1388. Well, let's check these and see if we are correct. Okay, I'm going to load up the answers. As you can see, we were correct, 1388. And we've got 62, E3, 1EA, 1FF, 
33A, 3EA, A4A, E9F, FA7, 1388. Okay, that's it for this video. Please tune in for 1.7 coming up shortly. Thank you very much indeed.